All right. You go and get Finn's medications. I'm trusting you. Yes, I need to speak with someone. It's an emergency. Oh God, come on. No, 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 I can't help. This is extremely important. Oh, can someone please tell me why did Lee not wait until she got outside of the apartment to call for help? Of course, Sheila was going to hear her, and of course, she was going to come out there. That was just insanely crazy. Like, what were you thinking, Lee? You had done so well up to this point with convincing Sheila that you were on her side, and then you make this type of mistake. What is going on? Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to a Bold and the Beautiful preview and spoilers for the week of June 20th. Let's get into it. So I really was impressed with Lee on Friday's episode because she played into Sheila's need to be loved and to be liked by someone and called her Finn's mother. And she was doing everything right. So it really bothered me on this preview that she's gonna make this mistake next week. And I know there's been a spoiler out for a while that someone dies in June. Now I'm starting to think that it's going to be Lee. Drop down in the comments let me know your thoughts because we know Sheila does not like being betrayed and she is going to go ballistic. So let's get into the other spoilers for next week. Even though Carter slipped the engagement ring on Quinn's finger on Friday, it does look like he's going to propose to Paris next week. It's a nearly flawless stone it's gonna make some lucky woman very happy someday so yes even though his heart is clearly with quinn he's going to go forward with proposing to paris and they're actually going to move their wedding date up when they get pushed back from family and friends. Now, it says that Paris is going to go as far as to instigate an argument with her mother after flaunting her engagement ring. Like, see, I told you so. But wait, Paris, because I'm hearing that the week of the 27th, Quinn and Bridget catch Don and Eric in bed. And she is going to rush to um, stop Quinn, stop Paris and Carter's marriage. So we will have to see who gets the last laugh there. So on Monday and Tuesday, Sheila and Lee receive an unexpected surprise. I'm assuming that there's some more movement with Finn waking up. But then on Wednesday, a frightened Lee makes a run for her life. So I'm assuming that's when it all unfolds that Lee tries to leave to get the medicine and turn Sheila in and Sheila catches her. Now I did see another spoiler that there's going to be a car chase and an accident. I do believe that is how Lee will die. I'm not sure, but we will see. So it sounds like before Quinn catches Eric in bed with Donna, he actually makes a decision because he says he's going to give Donna some joyous news. So I guess that heart to heart with Hope worked and he made a decision between the two ladies. But before he can tell Quinn, it says that Quinn and Bridget are going to make a shocking revelation about his, quote, exercise. <laughs> So those are your main spoilers for this upcoming week. We also have several of the cast members in Monte Carlo. If you're not following them on Instagram, you may want to. Jackie and Tanner have already posted some pics, so you might want to check those out. Jackie made a really cute reel of everything that's been going on day one. I think Catherine Kelly Ling is still healing from her um, broken ankle. Um, so what do you guys think about the spoilers for next week? Do you think we're going to lose Lee? as she tussles with Sheila. And do you think they're trying to redeem Sheila? Because if she is the one that presents Finn back to Steffi and the Forrester family, that could be her way back in. I really like to know your thoughts on that. Thanks for watching. Please like the video, share, subscribe, and I'll catch you on the next one.